So this video is just a quick tip on how to actually imp increase your storage for OneDrive for business. So um, if this is assuming that you're actually an administrator for your Office 365 or your comp, which I am. So I'll just show you quickly just to let you understand what's going on. So um, I, ha I have, have this problem. I'm actually in the middle of fixing it. So I figured I'd record a video because I had to figure out how to do it. And I'm sure some people might run into it in the future. See here? Got a little X there. Nothing is syncing anymore, and it's just not syncing. It's failing. It's failing because because I'm out of storage. I have one gig, one gigabyte storage on my Office 365, and so things are just starting to fail right, left, right, center. Now we're not gonna get into the debate of whether one Office is better than Google Drive or whatever. That's just what I use for my stuff, and yeah, so it's failing. So anyway. Um, and then I got a notification somewhere here. Oh, I might have cleared it. But and this one, this one, this one here. Free up storage, <clears throat> right? You click on that. It takes you. So to, I know a lot of people I'm keep to, making a ton. I'm gonna have to blur some of this stuff out, but it takes you here. It tells me I'm over storage by 114 percent, and that's it. Right, so this is what we're gonna to try to get solved right now. So, and then what's crazy is it wants you to start deleting files, but the truth is I don't want to delete anything because I don't know where half my stuff is. And frankly, I got some organization to do that I've just been kicking off. So we're just gonna kick this can further down the road. So I'm gonna come across, assuming that you're in Office 365, you go to the, click on these three little waffle menu, I think they're calling it, click on the admin, okay. Good to hear again. I'm gonna have to blur some of this stuff out. And then my recollection is I have to come down and go all the way to SharePoint. Because turns out that OneDrive is actually using SharePoint in the background. Then we're gonna click on settings. Is it settings? Yeah, let's see. Yeah, we're gonna click on settings. If you don't see settings here, click on the show all. Or more uh yeah, just settings. Just settings. Ignore what I said. I don't know why. I think there's, there's supposed to be some more stuff here. Then you'll come across the OneDrive storage limit. Click on that. It's going to give you this option here. And then you just basically copy this guy. Put that in here. That'll give you 512s of storage. My understanding is that it's free. Every single thing is relatively. It's not truly free, but you can upgrade to this no problem. And then you need to go back to your user. So admin center again, users. Again, I'm gonna have to blur some of this stuff out so that so names and so I don't get taken down on YouTube. And then I click on this, it's gonna give me the option to edit it. And then I could change this guy OneDrive here. Wait for it, wait for it, there we go, edit. I should be able to now change this to the maximum, which is 512. Oops. Hmm. Okay, let's put 4,000 as an example. Nope. Maximum user for this letter. Same as organization default. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so I can't, I can just do that. Yeah, sorry. Save. So let's see what happens just to make sure that it's actually changing. Yes, there we go. So same as organization default limit per user, 512. I don't know why I can't change this. This might just be a time thing. I'm almost certain that eventually this will work, right? Because it's already recognized that the organization limit is higher. So in theory, if we come back here, click on this, click on free up space now. Come here. I should start seeing let's just see just to make sure there we go 43 percent to use or this might be just be for this particular folder so I think it might just take a little bit of time uh, if not I'm gonna come back to you in this video and I'll tell you the progress but I think um, that should change in a bit yeah, that should give you the extra storage and eventually you'll start seeing this thing. I think it just takes a little bit of time for things to sync up. If not, leave a comment in the chat. Let me know if you're still having problems. We will figure this out together and um, 
I'll see you in the next video. And by the way, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Thanks for your time. Have a good day.